Thanks for boxing day dig. Ship them out. Um, on the Shoeven River. Just due to lack of being out lately. We've just pretty much pulled up on the spot, having a dig. Little inlet here which is good for panning, actual rivers flowing down along the other side of us there. So now we're not filling the actual river up. Got my brother and his other half over from Norway. Thought we'd take him out and let him get the hands dirty. Having fun? Yeah. I've found some nice specks. Just out of the front there. with a bit of colour. This spot is showing a little bit of promise. See you later. Well, we're still digging. Yeah. I'm trying to scrape out under this log that's falling down here. Talking to myself. Um, we did some test panning out of here. And well, we got some initial colours. Once we got down a bit, it just seemed to disappear. We did a clean out. We got some gold, but again, nothing special. Harry and Camilla still panning. There's some whole heap of little ropes. out from this tree here very fine little things but there seems to be a lot of gold caught up in there um, taking a little chunk just out of there of the root mass just to run through the high banker very hard to work as you can see as you go down it looks like there's some decomposing slate in there as well it starts getting a little bit clay in some parts but there doesn't seem to be any gold down near the slope for some reason. That's the concentrates we had out of our first run.
can show you. The sun's gone away again for a little while. It's nice while the clouds are out. Warms up very quickly when the sun comes out. More later. <coughs> this was the gold we pulled out for today. Point two, I'll just have point two. Not bad for what we did. Nothing spectacular, but we only really did a couple of hours digging. Got a few bigger bits than we normally find out there. Probably around 30 mesh. I don't really think I'm going to be able to get in there though. We had it China. It's a um, beautiful morning. We arrived yesterday. Had a little bit of a dig, but kind of did more yapping than anything. I think the yeah, um, Parramatta Prospecting Clubs here is hell of a lot of people over the other side of the creek. We were lucky enough to dig a dude and do that back out here. It's about junk. Well, we'll just set up down there, I'm working next to um, dig a dude. Found some nice size flake. Um, I think Digger Dude's doing alright where he is. We didn't quite get it as much as they did, but I don't think we did the digging anyway. We did have, we stuck the pan at the end of the high banker on the last dig we did. We didn't clean out the mats, but we did have a huge piece of gold in the end of the pan. I'm not sure if the clay either robbed it or if it was caught up in the clay and then we broke it up in the pan down the bottom in the end or if it did just float through the sluice. So we're going to play around a bit this morning and try and check what our losses are a bit better. Make sure we've got it set up. Marcus and have a glass out in the high bank down there. Alright, some more later. Yeah, sorry about that. This is about a half hour um we were a bit worried yesterday because we had a big chunk in the pan at the end of the sluice. I'm trying to get this focus, sorry. Just stick a thumb in there, see if that works. But um for a half hour run, this is really nice. So we're going to continue on, we'll probably play around a little bit with this loose but I'm not as worried as I was yesterday after seeing that, right, more later. Working very clay material at the moment. What we're trying to do is break up as much of it in the hopper as we can. And it's just 
got a pair there catching material, let them break up a bit. And we're rerunning it through the fire banker. Um, I was a bit worried about losses yesterday as we had a really big chunk in the catch pan at the bottom. But after checking the mat we had a really good run just with 20 minute run, so I'm not as worried as I was. Although it was a nice bit of go with this. Um, I'm hoping it was just clay that caught it and dropped it in the pan, that's why we're rerunning the pan from below. We've got some really big rocks out from this hole we're in at the moment. Seems like as soon as you get one of these rocks out, there's just some really nice go blowing underneath. I've been a little bit with the water, we've um, packed the water down a little bit, we've played around with the angle, we feel it's running a lot nicer now. Right, this was our take for the little dig we had. Not bad for us, not bad for what we did. A few nice bigger bits in there. Quite happy with that. We'll weigh it up later and see what it is. Well... Wow. 